There are still Harry stories coming out, and he's done his celebrity interviews, he's published his book, he's rolled the dice. He's probably um, given out his best. And, uh, you know, in America, they wheeled out Tom Hanks to sort of boost his popularity. And he did quite a credible, a creditable um, skit with Tom Hanks and some pipers and so on. Perfectly reasonable. And indeed, the little, the little stories he tells, he's affable, he's genial, he's pleasant, he's vulnerable. Uh, I would have said he makes good telly, but I think the rumours coming out is that the ratings are not terribly high. And Meghan Markle tried to do a pitch a while ago, and it all fell foul and didn't happen. Apparently she wanted rehearsal time. She wanted a hand-picked audience. She wanted all the questions in advance and so on. The sort of thing that you would get if you were going to be promoting a film. Well, it's slightly different when you're promoting a prince. Uh, the world media really wants an in-depth interview, the sort of Prince Andrew um, sensation. Instead, what they're getting is a promo for the, later, for the latest blockbuster, and I don't think it is the latest blockbuster. And I can't really imagine somebody wanting to, um, wanting to make a film of Spare, for example. The film rights are not going to be available, so there's nothing in there. There might be a little bit more mileage in some of the gossip about Meghan Markle giving out goodie bags with weed um, in them in Jamaica. Who knows? Who knows even if that's true? Who cares? Um, I think Harry has given his best effort. And at the moment, the bigger story is moving on to the response. Will he be invited to the coronation? Will he? Will the people in the current government, particularly on the back benches, succeed in promoting ideas that he should be stripped of his titles? He cannot be stripped of his role as a prince. He was born to that. So if he was stripped of being Duke of Sussex, his children would then automatically become princes, I suppose. He would be the prince and she would be the princess. Um... You know, I don't... They could cash in on that as well. Um, the idea that he should become Mr. Windsor is absurd. It's absurd. And Harry's response to all this is, well, I could have said more. I could have said more. I could have written twice the book. I, I could have... When it came out, when, it, when, when the first draft was twice the length, and I told my ghostwriter... So many extra stories just for context. I told him, you can't use this. This this would be appalling. My father, my brother would never forgive me. But um, can he forgive himself? And has he lost that star quality that he certainly had a couple of years ago? Has he lost it? Has he tarnished his own brand? My feeling is that he has. And I don't think he can recover from that. Except possibly by being welcomed back into the family fold. And I fear that won't happen this side of a divorce. <laughs>